Merry Christmas, everyone, to all of you out there that is currently watching this video. May you have a fantastic day or night wherever you live, and I really hope that you got everything you wanted for this Christmas day, either by getting a present you want, being with family or friends, or just taking some me time and chilling at home. Whatever the case may be, whatever makes you happy, I hope you do today, and I hope you have a very content and enjoyable rest of your day. And I appreciate you using some time of your day to sit down and watch my video. I greatly appreciate that, and I just, I wanted to send those good vibes to all of you before I really get into what this video is about, which is about Konosuba and other little miscellaneous topics. But before I really dive headfirst into this, I just want to say, thank you. And the reason why I'm saying thank you is because 2023 has been quite the year for me. I set out a goal at the beginning of the year to upload a video every single day for 2023, and thus far, this is the 25th of December, I have managed to do that. I have completed my objective. I have uploaded technically over a year now without missing one day of a video upload, which is an incredible feat. I know not many people might care about that, but that's a huge accomplishment in my book, and I'm just, I was happy I was able to stay committed and at the very least get one video up per day. But also, I want to extend my gratitude to all of you out there that watch my content, because it's like, you know, I make content to talk about anime, to talk about things I enjoy or just want to discuss at the time, and, you know, I know not everybody's going to watch every single video upload, but for those that have watched my content sporadically throughout this year, I greatly appreciate it because I wouldn't be a content creator, I wouldn't be a YouTuber if it wasn't for all of you sticking with me and putting up with me over all these years and especially this year because I've had a lot of ups and downs. Anyone that has watched my content or looked at social media, what I posted, etc., knows that, you know, I had some mental health issues, you know, as of late, the past few months ago, and I have been correcting and getting that all solved and worked out. And thanks to all of your guys' support and helping me out and just cheering me on, it's really helped me. And I, I feel like, you know, you guys are basically my second family. So it makes me very happy to know that I have you guys and you guys look out for me and I can bring you some form of entertainment as well. And I get messages all the time for people on social media or on YouTube where people are like, hey, Chibi, you know, your video has made me happy. Your video has given me a smile. It's helped me through the day. And when I get messages like that, it really means so much to me. And I feel like if there's any gift that I truly want from Christmas, it's stuff like that. It makes me very happy to see, you know, people telling me that I've helped them through their day or helped them feel better and all that. That is the greatest gift. And it is the greatest feeling as a content creator. And I just, I'm very happy I can do that. I'm very happy I can bring joy to those out there. Now, enough with the mushy stuff, let's get into what this video is actually about. And this came out earlier this morning, and FYI, I didn't expect this, maybe there was others that expect it, but this was a trailer that dropped on Christmas morning, and it is Konosuba Season 3's first PV trailer, our first look at Konosuba's anime for Season 3, and we got an announcement for when it's coming out. It's coming out April 2024 my birthday like yo another series coming out on my birthday like yo april is looking to be good we're gonna have like mushiku tensei and then we're gonna have konosuba like oh my goodness man it's going to be a good month for anime when april finally arrives so um this trailer came out we got a release date, obviously. We got some voice actors in this. And it, even the art and animation, oh my goodness, it's so amazing seeing these characters back and all that, the derpiness and the, the comedic effect of the characters. Like, even Aqua? Like, oh yes, be a witch. I got a Konosuba shirt on. I don't know if you noticed that, but yeah, I have Aqua on my shirt. So, I'm a Konosuba fan. I love the series, and I'm so glad. It's been... How many years has it truly been since we've had a continuation of Konosuba? I'm not counting the Megamine spinoff or whatever. I'm talking about, like, Konosuba Season 2 when it aired. I believe it aired, like, in 2019? I, I believe 2020? I, I, it, it's been a long time, okay? It's been a very long time since Konosuba Season 2 came out. It's nice to finally have Season 3 just so close and it's quickly approaching because it seems like the life and care and attention detail is still there. The derpiness of the characters and all that. Megamede's here, like, oh my goodness. Like, and darkness as well, like, oh. <laughs> it's going to be a legitimately good, enjoyable watch. One thing I do want to say is, is obviously Konosuba, it's very subjective in terms of you like it because it's about comedy. And if you don't like the comedy of Konosuba, it's not going to be your type of show because it's literally 
there, there's just comedy. And I, I feel like there's a correlation, though. If you enjoy Overlord or ReZero, etc., those type of stories, you're probably going to enjoy Konosuba. Because just the comedy really parodies those themes and stuff of those stories. And it's great. And I feel like Kazuma as well, he's kind of like a little bit closer, similar to Subaru from ReZero. And to make it kind of more obvious is that the offers are, you know, friends. You know, the offer of ReZero and the offer of Konosuba are friends. And there is some similarities between the characters obviously they're a lot different as the story progresses but it's just like at least at the starting point there there is a lot of similarities i just i like that as well but anyways b back onto the main point is that this trailer is legitimately a great trailer we get our first real good look at the art and animation and it looks good, but also derpy at the exact same time, which I think is the big point of Konosubo. What's the drawing factor? Is that it needs to have this weird artwork to make it look just off, but also it needs to flow very well to be actually enjoyable. Now, um, I know a few things about some certain spoilers on, like, characters and stuff because i've just been spoiled years ago it's stuff that's gonna ruin you know this season for me because obviously it's all about comedy but i do want to point that out i'm not going to say those spoilers for the sheer fact i don't want to ruin the surprise for anyone but uh i cannot wait for certain things to happen for this season if it actually happens but uh yeah i i can't wait man i legitimately cannot wait for more konosuba it's going to be an absolute blast um, with that being said, though, I do also want to mention something. This is a little bit off topic, but if you are, you know, feeling the Christmas spirit and you're wanting to watch something Christmas-themed, I recommend watching Toradora episode 19. I believe it's episode 19. And what I mean is, is that there's a full-themed Christmas episode for Toradora. If you've watched this a long time ago, just pull it out and watch episode 19 and all that. It's a very cute episode that's just all about Christmas-themed, and... I, I like this. I, I wish more anime had Christmas-themed episodes, by the way. Like, I, I don't know what it is. You go back, like, 8 to 10 years ago, there was always OVAs or Christmas episodes, even if it was anime original for shows. But nowadays, we don't really get them as much anymore, which is kind of sad. I, I think it's legitimately sad we don't get many Christmas moments anymore. Um... I, I wish we could get back to this trend because it was very wholesome and very enjoyable. I, I want this more. I, I hope we get more of that. And the same could be said also for like Halloween. I would like more Halloween themed episodes as well because we used to get those too. So it's just, it's incredibly strange to me. We don't get wholesome stuff like this. But uh, with that being said though, if you're wanting something more on the spicy variety of Christmas anime, kiss this. If you know, you know. That's all I'm going to say. I'll leave it at that. But uh, anyways, thank you so much for putting up with me this year. I hope you all have a Merry Christmas, Happy Holidays, and a fantastic New Year. You know, I love you guys, and if you enjoyed this video, do leave me a like. It does help me out a lot, and it would be a nice little Christmas gift, too. But uh, <laughs> jokes aside, um, be safe, guys. Chibi out.